what's going on guys? Christian Hannah Horror here today. So I'm getting ready to go on vacation and I want to make some pretty cool content for you guys to check out while I'm away. So one thing we're going to look at right here is something I often get questions about. My life-size killer clown from outer space. Where'd I get it? What's the story? So let's go ahead and explain this. You can make this happen, guys. Maybe just not exactly the way I do, but it's possible. So the head you're seeing right now is from Creation X. Now, I don't think Mike is making these anymore. I think these were actually a one-time thing. He did this clown, the short clown that had the boxing gloves on, and then I think he did one more clown that I can't remember the character's name. But that's where I got this head from. But there are options. There are some pretty good Trick or Treat Studios killer clown masks you can get. Now, the actual costume you're seeing, this body piece, is from uh, Trick or Treat Studios, excuse me. The shoes right there are just cheap $10 clown shoes, $10 clown gloves that I got off of eBay, and the mannequin body, respectively, is off of eBay as well. It's just a general male mannequin, and you can actually take the mannequin off of its stand, being able to dress it up, if you will. Now, the tassel neck piece that's pink actually did come with Rudy from Creation X. I did not get the, the neck piece from Trick or Treat Studios. So that would be something you guys would even have to try to make or get your hands on like that because that came with the clown mask from Mike over at Creation X. But luckily, because he put the pink neck piece on there, I was able to get the costume that was the same from the movie. Now, I don't think this is exactly screen accurate, guys. I think this clown might have wore like a polka dotted dark color costume, but you know, it is what it is. But this is it, guys, my Creation X style killer clown, um, and he's pretty awesome. I think you guys would agree uh, that mask is pretty legit. Now, this is a very expensive mask. Trick or Treat Studios isn't going to give you this high of quality. But that's not a big deal. Trick or Treat's Killer Clown Mask actually look pretty good. I actually bought one of them, and they're, they're not bad. But this is actually a really thick foam fill that I had to uh, place on the mannequin's head uh, through a little bit of trial and tribulation, but I got it. That way he's very secure, and he just looks absolutely fantastic. A fabulous paint job on him. So if you want your own Killer Clown, guys, go out and make it your own reality.